Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode of Pixark. Oh yeah, today we're getting into some new stuff. I just crafted the industrial smelter. I'm curious how big this thing is. Oh, it's not that big. Awesome. It's, it's big, but it's not like gonna take up your entire house type situation. You know, it's, it's a good size. So let's see. Uh, I want it faced this way. We'll have to bring it out away from the wall a little bit. Not bad. And then I want to, oh yeah, see, I'm not going to have a whole lot of room for all that. But okay, so this requires gasoline to operate, put unrefined resources in there, in resources in there to refine them. Uh, and with this, we can make steel. So I have just a smidgen of gasoline. There we go. Uh, we could turn this on and we could take iron and coal and turn it uh, into steel. So let me go ahead and grab a little bit of coal there. Uh, we can go ahead and turn this on and craft 32 steel. So I'm gonna run back into the base. I'm gonna grab whatever iron we have left as well, uh, which should be a bit ingots, ores. Uh, I should have, yeah, a little bit of iron there. And then let's hit the ingots up. Um, do I have any more iron in here? I sure don't. Wow, I'm actually a little surprised uh, in that. So let's go ahead and put this. Can now can I smelt normal ores in here? I don't think I can. I think it's still required to have one of these, which I think is a little weird in my opinion. I don't know that I entirely agree with that thought process. But, you know, it's one of those things. All right, so to make gasoline, we need barrels of oil. And there's a little thing that um, you can make, and I don't remember what it's called. Aha, there it is. Petroleum slime incubator uh, that is going to require a couple of different things to make. And this is crafted in the fabricator. So we're going to go ahead and make this. Let's see. What are we going to require? Structures, dinos. Uh, this is going to take eight glass windows and four iron foundations. Um, the iron foundation, iron foundation is right there. Okay. That, I wonder if it's going to be in here or if it's just going to be in my inventory. Oh, you know what? It's probably going to be in here. Iron, iron foundation. Uh, there it is. All right. So it's going to take one iron ingot a piece. We can come over here and grab what I just smelted up. Perfect. I know it's a, I know it's a little dark in the video, but uh, it should be all right. Foundation. All right. I just want to craft four. Craft those. Okay. And then I should be able to grab glass, uh, which I might have here or I might have in the ingots. Yeah, there it is. All right. Glass windows. Maybe that's in here as well. Glass windows. Yep. All right. And then we're just going to want to craft eight of those. Why can I not craft eight? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, no. Yeah. Seven, eight. Okay. We got that. Come over here to the fabricator. Oh man, I'm out of oil in that too. Wow. Okay. My oil is, my oil situation is running incredibly low. Let's see. I don't see anything there. I don't see any oil there. Oh man. Am I out of oil? Like, am I completely out of oil? I think I might be completely out of oil. I need, yeah, yeah, that's not good. That's not good at all. Um, cause that's, yeah, oof, oof. I need to go get some barrels of oil. All right. So I'm going to have to go find some petroleum slime. All right. So let's go ahead and fire up the forge. Uh, oh, it's under dinos. That's what we want. We want the petroleum slime cage. Oh no. Petroleum slime incubator, uh, that we can go ahead and put down and these guys will start to make oh wow this is big um let's go ahead and put it yeah it looks like all the sides are basically the same so let's go ahead and put that down uh use catch to get oil slime put charcoal in and use product to get 
oil, the more dinos the building, the faster you can. Okay. Um, so let me come over here. Uh, I have a petroleum slime. Let's go ahead and toss you down. Catch petroleum slime. Okay. Does that mean he's now in there? Yeah, there's now one in here. Uh, so that's good. And then we can put in charcoal, which I should have right over here in my wood box. Yep. Charcoal. I'm going to put in as much as I can. I got 210. All right. Oh, look at him. He's in there. Hi, buddy. Uh, all right. And then just put that there. Can no, give me that. Actually. I want to make sure that these stacks are full. All right, go ahead and do that one, that one, and that one. Produce petroleum. Time remaining 20 hours? You're kidding, right? It's going to take 20 hours to get more petroleum? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> uh, okay, the faster, yeah. That's crazy. 20 hours? I mean, that's just a little redonkulous, but you know what I'm going to do? I think I'm going to go and try to tame up maybe one or two more petroleum slimes and see if, uh, if we can get them. I, mm, I don't know if I'm going to be able to, because I don't know if I have quite enough. Um, yeah, just cause I don't have enough time today to wait on that. Uh, as far as like other stuff in here goes, we, we have a bunch of the steel stuff, so I want to make a little bit of that. Uh, so let's go ahead and learn some Ingrams from the steel. Uh, and then the scuba would be great, but we're going to need like stuff like polymer and, and whatnot, uh, which is going to be hard to come across at this exact moment. So let's see. Um, steel armor and weapons and whatnot. Weapons, sword, steel ingots. Going to require 20 of them. Let's go ahead and make that butamus sword. Give it to me. All right, we got 38 steel. So that's that's a decent amount. That's a good amount. Uh, let's go ahead. Weapon, sword, craft. And then let's look at uh, armor. Armor, riot. Oh, yeah. Steel is considered riot. And this is going to require polymer. So we're going to have to work on our polymer situation quite a bit. Uh, but shouldn't be too bad. Gas mask. Uh, polymer is just bone ash and clay. Uh, really, the bone ash should be really easy. It's just going to be a matter of me getting more clay. But let's pull out the sword. All right. That's, that's looking pretty awesome, actually. Just kind of running around with it. Yeah, not bad. All right, let's, uh, let's run over to the... Area that we normally check out. Hey, are you a one-hit kill? Ooh, dang, you're a one-hit kill. Um, let's run into here. Bum, 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 bum. Gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Two hits. One hit. Does these respawn yet? No. Dang. All right. So, not bad. I'm kind of digging the steel sword. I definitely enjoy the look. But look at that. Just completely destroyed these guys. Not sure why these boxes are not uh, respawning just yet. I need water. All right, let's get up here and take you guys out. Boom. Aha, yes. All right, I think I'm going to work towards a good bit more on the iron situation. I know I've got a lot that I can harvest down below and turning it into steel and then i would try to like to get some polymer so we can get the steel armor all right a good amount of farming later and let's check out this armor steel primitive boots steel gloves steel helmet steel pants and steel chest plate oh man how much armor are we looking at here? Uh, with that, we're at 145. If we were in the iron, we're looking at um, 110. So a good bit more armor value on this. Now, I can't find the spring boots. Um, if I look here, the steel spring boots can only be crafted at the fabricator. But if I come over here... 
da, 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 and look in here and I type in spring or if I type in boots, there are no steel spring boots in here and they're not in the fabricator. They're not in the regular workbench. Um, I don't know where they would technically be besides those two spots. So I'm assuming they're just either maybe broken at the moment or something. Um, I will say that I'm a little disappointed in the fact of how they look. Um, I thought my bone stuff looked way cooler, but if we look here, there is stone or steel bone gloves, steel bone helmets, all that stuff. We can definitely get into some steel bone, but I mean, it's, it kind of is really cool looking. I got to admit, um, I'm a little disappointed in it, but, um, you know, not really that bad. I colored my sword and, uh, I'm ready to like take someone out like, let's go, let's kill somebody. Rah. Raw, raw, raw. Um, so yeah, I mean, super awesome um, that we got to this. It's uh, it's quite a bit of an effort, but I think it's pretty much worth it uh, for what we had. It's a little little bit of an upgrade, not by much, but still pretty awesome. Though I don't know that I can give up my spring boots. I love my spring boots so much. Uh, what is the armor difference between my boots? So these are twenty five, and if I put on my spring boots, those are six. Wow, that is a significant difference, but just being able to jump really high is like super just helpful in all kinds of situations. But we're getting so much stuff kind of taken care of here. I'm I'm loving it. I am absolutely loving the fact that we've got this here. We've got the the slime pit. We've got just different stuff. Might need to start uh, increasing the base size, but for now, I think we're pretty good. So I think I might want to make a couple of the other pits and whatnot that are uh, kind of around. Uh, let's take a look here. There is uh, something to do with dodos. Yeah, we got the dodo nest, and then there is a Fiomia hut. So let's see. Uh, hut. We have Fiomia... Fiomia. Oh, maybe that's in the workbench. Uh, structures. Dino. No, no dino. No dino. Fiomia hut. Oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, we need clay ceilings. We need three clay ceilings. I don't have... I had a couple little other pits. Oh, wow. This one's really big. Um, ooh, I don't know if I want this one to be in the courtyard. How big is this one? Oh, this is the, the dodo pit. That's not bad at all, but the Fiomia one is just ginormous. Uh, let's go ahead and put it down. We'll take a look at it. Um, can't open that. Use to catch for, uh, and to receive Fiomias. Put in materials and then produce to get fertilizer. The more dinos you have in, the, of course, more useful it is. And then this one does the same thing. Um, put berry in to feed capture dodos to produce eggs and more dodos. Uh, the better. So awesome. We can put um, dodos in here and we can put Fiomias in the other one and we can get eggs and we can get uh, other stuff too. So uh, quite a bit of awesome stuff. I think, let me see, do I have a Stego still? No, I have that trike. So let me grab that trike. Go ahead and whip you out of there. Grab my saddle, uh, trike saddle, trike, 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 uh, triceratops, yeah, primitive, mastercraft, I'm going to take myself a mastercraft saddle, we will take this triceratops out and uh, gather some berries, and I'm going to try and tame me up some uh, dodos, alright, so here's a couple of dodos, I don't have any fiomias near me at the moment, but we should be able to go ahead and Oh, capture. Do they have to be females? Oh, no, I got two males. Oh, all right. Well, unfortunately, I can't find female dodos to save my life. I've looked all over. Cannot find them. Need to get some water. There we go. Um, but yeah, we're still rocking the steel armor. It's looking pretty good, though. I look like I could dig out a mountain with my uh, forehead. But uh, yeah, I'm thinking this stuff is pretty neat. Uh, we're not far off. I am level 61 already. I mean, it's it's so much um, just digging and, and leveling like that that it's not bad. Um, there's nothing appeared in there, and these guys are useless. Uh, and then we've got this, so we'll have to find some Fiomias. So quite a bit of different stuff that I need to get going. 
But uh, yeah, I think we had a good episode today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the steel madness that we got going on. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one. 